Learn to lead. We make winners who lead. Hello students. Greetings from Firebird Institute of Research and Management. In this video, we are going to analyze MAD 2022 December exam question paper. The MAD exam was conducted in the month of December as well as in the September 2022. Already we have provided September 2022 question paper analysis and also we discussed few of the questions from September MAT question paper in our previous videos. Hope you have all watched those videos and it was very useful. And in this video, we have discussed uh, December MAT 2022 question paper. Okay, so let us begin. And before starting with the question paper analysis we just want to give you some introduction about the exam pattern those who are new to our uh, channel now this uh, math exam pattern consists of five parts mathematical skills language comprehension data analysis and sufficiency intelligence and critical reasoning indian and global environment from each section you will get 40 questions so in total you need to attend 200 questions and there is no sectional timing for all the five sections. The total time allotted is 150 minutes. And the MAT exam, it is conducted four times a year in an academic year. And it is conducted in three modes nowadays, IBT, computer-based test, and paper-based test. The duration of the test, as I already told, it is uh, two hours, 30 minutes. And total questions that was asked in the exam is 200 questions. Okay. And then mathematical skills. Okay, let us start with the analysis of mathematical skills. See, uh, if we take mathematical skills, there are totally 40 questions. And in the overall, they have covered all the topics, right? So if we see topic-wise questions, trigonometry, this time they have asked one question, Percentage 2, permutation and combination 3 questions. And based on simple interest and compound interest, they have asked 5 questions. Time, speed and distance 4 questions. Allegation and mixture 3 questions. Menstruation 3 questions. Profit and loss 2 questions. Pipes and system 2. Time and work 2 questions. Average 2 questions. Ratio 1. HCF and LCM. So HCF and LCM is a very basic concept. So they are giving uh, more importance for this HCF and LCM. So those who are starting with their preparation, just first go through HCF and LCM, which is very, very important, and it will be useful to solve all the other topics also. Geometry, two questions. Boats and streams, uh, two. Probability, two questions. Basic, max, one question. So totally, they have asked 40 questions. In 40 questions, almost they have covered all the topics. So just be thorough with the topics like permutation, combination, Simple interest, compound interest, time, speed, and distance, time and work. Because based on these topics, the number of questions are both. Each time they're asking more number of questions. So first, in mathematical part, be thorough with the percentage concepts, LCM and HCF concepts. Just try to solve more questions based on simplification. That is to improve your mathematical skills part. This is very important. Now, so definitely in the same uh, star, uh, strategy like uh, same way you can expect the questions from all these topics in the upcoming Feb as well as Mat ex, uh, May Mat exams. Okay, and next language comprehension. So as I told you early, uh, forty questions are based on language comprehension. One word substitution four. Then uh, they have divided sentences into few parts and they are they ask you to organize those sentences. Okay, so in this type they have asked four questions. And error spotting four, meaning four, and reading comprehension two, reading comprehension they have asked. In each reading comprehension, there will be five questions. So totally 10 questions were based on reading comprehension. And two word substitution, fill in the blanks type four question, opposite meaning four. See, they are asking question based on synonyms as well as antonyms. Then logical paragraph sentence rearrangement three, and uh, summaries three, meanings, idioms, and say, phrases four. So these are the marks allotted in each topic and these are the types in which they have asked these questions in language comprehension and next when we come to intelligence and critical reasoning so they have co almost covered up to 
14 topics in intelligence and uh, critical reasoning, right? And similarly, in mathematical skills, there are almost 17 topics. Okay, in intelligence and critical reasoning, they have covered almost 14 topics. Okay, coding and decoding, two questions. Calendar one, puzzle five. That is, they'll ask you one, they'll give you one puzzle. And based on that puzzle, if you solve that puzzle, they'll ask you five questions. Okay, they'll ask you five questions. Okay, and then arrangement type one, direction one. And so, in puzzle type, there are three questions. Totally 15 marks are based on puzzle type questions. The puzzle can be of arrangement or blood relation or directions, any type. Okay. And then next coming to missing term, one question. Assertion and reasoning, five questions they have asked. Coding and decoding, two. Calendar, one. Arrangement, one. Direction, one. And then clock, one. Blood relation. See, uh, in December, March 2022 exam, they have also asked... Blood relation in puzzle problem also. And also separately they have asked two blood relations. Okay. In September, March 2022, in blood relation, they asked five questions. So those five questions are based on coding time. And this time they changed it into like the pattern is of puzzle type questions in blood relation. Totally seven marks they have allotted for blood relation. So keep it in mind. Try to solve all the types of problems in blood relation. So the first type is of uh, relationship type and the second type puzzle and the third type is coding, coding uh, coded relationship. Okay. And statement cause and effect, five questions based on this topic. And another puzzle they have asked, Venn diagram, based on Venn diagram, one question. Okay. So these are the marks allotted and these are the topics covered in intelligence and critical reasoning. Okay. And next when we take uh, data interpretation and data sufficiency. So totally there are eight questions. So, in each question, there are five questions. Sub five questions are there. And what are the types? Let us see. So, line and table type, data sufficiency type. Uh, there are they have asked ten questions based on data sufficiency. Okay, data interpretation and data sufficiency. Ten questions are based on data sufficiency, and remaining thirty questions are on data interpretation. Line and table, two pie charts type. Okay, they gave you. Uh, two pie charts and analyzing those two pie charts, you have to answer five questions. Then case that that is paragraph type. So you have to read the paragraph, you have to get the data, and after getting the data, you have to solve the five questions. Okay, and then line graph, bar graph, and line graph combined graph. Okay, and table type. Okay, these are the eight types of questions that were asked in data interpretation and data sufficiency in December March 2022 question. I hope you got some uh, basic ideas on all the topics, how to cover all the topics and what was the pattern in December March 2022 question paper. You can also visit our uh, September March 2022 question paper analysis video in our channel so that you will get more ideas on how to approach the next web as well as May March 2023 examinations. So you all have a good opportunity Harvard Institute of Research and Management is going to conduct a free workshop on steps to crack Feb Mark 2023 in 30 days on 28th December at 7 p.m. Those who want to enroll for this program, we have provided the registration link in the description box or else you can also contact 887 for direct registration. Don't forget to join this program. In this program, we are going to provide you September and December 2022 math question paper analysis. And we are also going to provide you the tips to develop your numerical ability part. We are also going to provide you the tips to score 550 plus in the upcoming May, Feb and May math 2023 examinations. All the best. Don't forget to join this webinar on 28th December at 7 p.m. Firebird is one of the few institutions in India who has invested in IMA Bus Lab facility. Here the students play a business simulation game wherein their decision making skills get sharpened. As an entrepreneur, the student takes important decisions as he plays the game and excels as he sees good results. Personality traits are very important when it comes to business. When dealing with a customer, it is important to have the skills of presenting the company and its offer. Firebird has taken a unique initiative of training in students with these business skills.
Learn to lead. We make winners who lead.